And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast. Weather from where you live. Hey, good Tuesday morning. You can see the moon shining bright in the western sky this morning. It'll set at about 644, but it certainly has a show tonight. We have a partial lunar eclipse, which will peak at about 1044. I'm posting it on my Facebook page, and I'll have more details here later in the newscast. But getting out the door this morning, we're sitting in the uh, mid to upper 50s, 56 Galveston, 59 Delphi, 57 here in Lafayette. Might need that light jacket, but we are clear overhead. But looking to the southeast, you can see the edge of the cloud cover. This is the remnants of the tropical low that worked into the Carolinas yesterday. It was not a named storm. It was not named a tropical storm Helene, which was projected to become Tropical Storm Helene, but it did not. It was just a low pressure system, but we did have some very strong gusts and some very heavy rainfall. The center of the low is right about here, but it's going to start to slow down where it's going to run into that upper level ridge that's over our viewing area and all this moisture is going to dry up over the next several hours. Unfortunately, we may just see the wind change a little bit. May cool our temperature down a degree or two, but otherwise it's going to be a hot, sunny day again today and very dry. I want to take a look here at future cast humidity levels. Humidity is really it kind of uh, goes up during the morning, during the evening hours, just because the temperature and the dew point gets so close together. But during the day, we have a big dew point depression when we have dew points very low and the temperature gets obviously very high, so the humidity goes way down. We're going to be seeing humidity levels about 30 to 40 percent, very dry air. We'll get some relief tomorrow as uh, humidity will be about 50 percent during the afternoon hours, but still very dry air, which is why we have uh, now added Fountain County to the burn ban list, and I do believe more counties will kind of follow in the days to come since we're still going to be very dry. But again, just Fountain County for right now, but still everybody take it easy out there because any fire can spread easy, even a, a cigarette butt, even just a kind of a sparks coming off of possibly some chains on a truck and spark a grass fire brush fire very easily under the conditions that we have. Tomorrow it'll be another dry sunny day. We'll have high temperatures back into the mid to upper 80s again with the east northeast wind northeasterly wind 5 to 10 miles per hour maybe making our temperature a little bit cooler with that east northeast wind. Getting to future cast, there is the remnants of that tropical low making its way up to the Appalachians. Everything will kind of dissipate fall apart. We will be sunny today tomorrow Thursday and going into Friday as well will be dry. This model's trying to bring in some rain for Saturday, but I do think we'll still be very dry. It's hard to get moisture in when we've been dry for so long, but I think we may see a stray chance on Monday. Possibly another cold front late next week, possibly Thursday, Friday. We'll keep an eye on it very closely. Regardless, we are very dry. 89 degrees Thursday, 90 Friday even warmer on Saturday. The good news is it's still going to be that dry heat. 92 Saturday, not that humid feel that we've been kind of used to all summer. But as we get toward uh, again next week, we'll be watching Monday for that isolated chance and even possibly by next Thursday could be watching for that cold front. But right now keeping chances pretty low given the very dry forecast that we have. Yeah, absolutely. So dry and and uh, you know, you've been talking about Helene, which never mm -hmm. actually came to fruition, no, which I not. thought was interesting and and that couldn't get us any rain either. Right. So yeah, dang. all that's kind of drying up and yeah. it's just keep, give, keeping us a very dry forecast right. and just take it easy out there for sure as uh, you know the fire conditions really start to ramp up mm -hmm. with Fountain County on a burn being band. the first one yep. in our viewing area underneath that burn band so expect a lot more to follow right yeah, possibly yeah, yes. absolutely all right thank you David mm -hmm. hey this time it's